Hey y'all, this is Zach with Mills Under Pressure. All right, tonight I'm gonna be making something that I call Creole beans. It's not red beans and rice. The history behind this recipe is I was trying to copycat Popeye's red beans and rice recipe. I totally failed, ended up with this recipe that everybody loved and I just called it Creole beans. Um, if you Google Creole beans, all you get is red beans and rice recipe. So I think that I kind of came up with this on my own. So I'm gonna show you what we got. I've got was a pound, <clears throat> pound of these small red beans. Uh, this is a no soak recipe. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have to you know, get these out and wash them and make sure there's no dirt rocks in it. So got my red beans. I'm gonna need some liquid smoke, some garlic, mixed garlic, a medium white onion. This was a uh, cayenne pepper. Use a little bit of that. Chili powder, your favorite Cajun or Creole season. I like to slap your mom, everybody knows that. They're watching my channel and a can of chicken broth. And I'm gonna use one can of chicken broth, but I'm gonna add two more cans of water. So I'll fill it up twice with water. Uh, that's it. So what I'm gonna do first, I'm gonna go ahead and get my, my beans separated, get everything cleaned out of them, and uh, we'll be back. All right, so this part's the simple part. I rinse my red beans, got to make sure I got all the little rocks and, and dirt, whatever out of them. So put those in. I got my can of chicken broth, which is two cups. And when you cook the beans, you always want to use six cups of liquid. So I got the two cups of the chicken broth. I got four cups of water. Put the lid on. Make sure it's set to the seal position. Hit the manual button or pressure cook button and bring it up to 45 minutes. So now I'll have time to cut my onion, get everything else uh, separated out. So, all right, we'll see y'all in a little bit. All right, so we cooked the red beans under pressure for 45 minutes with a natural release. Uh, so now you'll take the onion, and I kind of finely dice it. It's a medium soft white onion. I finely dice it. It just works better that way. That's going in there. Three tablespoons of minced garlic. Oops. All right, I've got a half a tablespoon of liquid smoke. Definitely need this for this recipe. Now, I've got a teaspoon of your favorite Cajun or Creole seasoning. I like Slap Your Mama, Tony Satcher's is also a good one. And I've got a teaspoon of chili powder. And then I've got just a quarter teaspoon of cayenne. So, that's in there. Get stirred up. I take your lid, make sure it's set to the seal position. Still got some heat and steam left over from when I, when I released the first time. All right, there we go. Hit the manual button or a pressure grip button, whatever's on your model, and bring it down, way down, to five minutes. So that's gonna let the onions and the seasoning get all cooked in. So five minutes. See y'all, five minutes. You did start on that one, right? Hmm? You did start on that one? No, you want to start on this one. So, oh, okay. one. so Five minutes in the whatever time it takes to come to pressure. All right, so we cooked it now for five minutes under pressure and I did a quick release. I was trying to hold it, but it's kind of hot. But I tell you this, really when good. I hit that, when I hit the vent to, to let the steam out, it smelled, made the house smell good. So this is Creole beans. Again, I think that I created this recipe um, by mistake, but whatever, it's, it's really good. Um, all right, if you like this, video like and subscribe to my youtube channel meals under pressure also we have a facebook group page called meals under pressure where we offer a free cookbook so we're gonna get down to eating this is too good to pass up so we'll see y'all next time